a wise person not too long ago basically destroyed the concept of atheism with one very important question, people. Question for all you atheists. If there's no God, then who is Jesus' dad? And that's a very good question that call themselves amazing, people. You know, you have atheists that think that they can do green screen on Windows Movie Maker. That doesn't make sense to me. And they, there's even atheists who, who think that they have their own video games, people. And that doesn't make sense to me. I mean, why can't atheists be more like this person here who listens to good Christian music and put a Christian band tattoo on their ass, people? I mean, that's Christianism to the max. And I think that's a good concept, people. Herb yielding seed and the fruit yielding fruit after his kind who seeded itself upon the earth and it was good. And the earth brought forth the grass and the herbal year. And the gathering together of the waters ceased. And God saw that it was good. And God said, Let the earth bring forth grass and the herb yielding seed and the fruit yielding fruit after his kind who seated himself upon the earth. And it was good. And they were both of the grass and the remote even and and the tree you can bring see was so and and this kind and the God said it was good and the and on the morning and it was the third day You should be a shit of yourself for not wanting to read this people What the fuck? That stupid show. I see that you're uh, you you are concerned about us, you know, us atheists, because you know you care about us. But the thing is, we don't need your help. I mean, granted that. It would have been nice if there was a god, but the god that we all know of is pretty much just a hateful bastard. I mean, in my eyes, god is more evil than good. Haven't you realized that those who read the Bible more and more become more of a jerk than a friend? They've become so self-centered that the only thing that they need in their life is the Bible. I don't want to become that person. I don't want to become a self-centered person just because of a book or a religion. No. I don't want to become that. I just wish there were less religious people who are more you know, that willing to say that it's important to worship God here and there and not every day. I just wish that more Christians are like that, but truth is, they're, they're not that many. They become more self-centered as, you know, as soon as they get more closer and closer to God. Is it a crime not to believe in God? I mean, if I was God, would I send you to hell if you didn't believe me? No. That's... That's just plain stupid. Hell, if you didn't think I exist, but you did some good, then you're welcome in my place. That's what I would do if I was God. Just as long as you do good, as you lived, then you're okay with me. If you're gay, and hell, you're okay by me too. <sighs> you wanna know something? Atheism is not a perfect religion. That's my point to admit. But 
I don't want to become one of those people who fill their heads with hot air. No. All I'm doing is just speaking up my mind against a certain religion. A religion that's been corrupted for nearly thousands and thousands of years. A religion that bashes gays. A religion that says we are superior to every other religion. I'm against that. No. It's okay by me if you want to believe in God. And it's okay if you want to do a little bit of prayer here and there. But it's not okay if you force it upon people who don't want to do it. It's not okay to change the world into what you see fit. I'm not trying to change the world. I'm just one guy who just sits on his chair, looked at his computer screen, and see on how corrupted the world is. I know definitely that stupid show TV. We are alike. We're brothers in arms. And, uh, well, if you believe in God, you're okay by me, bro. Oh, and, uh, to answer Psychosir's question, who's the son of Jesus Christ if God didn't exist? Anybody's! For all we know, Jesus Christ could have been adopted, and the parents could have been on ecstasy. And as for Mary Jane, if Mary Jane was really pregnant, and she really gave birth to Jesus Christ, then she's no fucking virgin. Somebody sticks his dick up her JJ and gave birth to Jesus Christ. Problem solved. You can't really believe the words from those stupid men back in the past. Because, according to the scientific research, some of them were schizophrenics. Yep, schizophrenics. But, you know what? Anything's possible at this point. So, I guess that's all for today. I am the Atheist Games. Fuck your god! Fuck him! Fuck him! Fuck your god! Peace to game.